Good afternoon. Well, I guess almost evening now. We are actually heading out on a rare date. <laughs> this doesn't happen very often for us because we have three children and it's hard to find a babysitter, but God has given us this amazing, wonderful uh, couple in our life who uh, are watching our kids tonight. And so we are so excited. We're gonna go out to the peddler. Um, pretty excited. I really wanna try their sirloin and I'm excited for the salad bar. So I hope you enjoy going on this adventure with us. Yeah, we have been to the peddler before. It's been a while. So they should have the salad bar back in play. We're gonna check out the salad bar. I'm excited for the salad bar and the river, as a fisherman, the riverside seating. We just recently went to the Greenbrier and she thought the Greenbrier steak was better. And I said, well, we need to go back to the peddler to see Alamo, peddler, Greenbrier. We gotta figure out where is the best steak in the Smokies. So we're gonna go to the peddler and we're gonna put their steak to the test. So join us, shall you? You shall. So we're running a little behind. So the GPS actually threw us on the bypass. Um, so actually we're having quite a nice little view and a nice little road drive that way. Yes. Um, <laughs> through the Smoky Mountain National Park. And it's actually just looking so pretty. Oh, oh, and show, we show can, them this view, show them this so, view. So we can, show them the view. Okay, let's... flip it around, flip it around. Ooh. Look oh look, there's the uh, over um, over tram going up. The over tram. Gotta... All right, we're on the end of the Gatlinburg area. We're trying to get to the peddler. I see it. I see it. There it is up here on the left. There oh, and there's is. the over the over tram coming in for a landing. <laughs> so we're. Oh, there's a spot. Yes, good good call. We got a spot. Right here in the front. Nice. All right, That's we've amazing. made it. We've made it to our reservation. To the peddler. <laughs> Before we get too far into this video, I did want to take a moment to show you the three ways that you can get a reservation at the peddler. The first is just simply roll the dice, show up, and hopefully it's not too busy, and put your name in. The location is right here. I'll put that in the description of the video. The second way that I recommend is you can call this number get call ahead seating and typically that opens up about an hour before they open so if it opens at five i'd be calling right at four to make sure you can get a table the third way that they've just added is you can book a table online using this resi reservation system so i'll put a link to this page down below in the comments so make sure you check that out at the end of this video but stay tuned i have a lot more tips coming your way let's head into the restaurant All right, so we did make it. We did get a seat here by the river. We're checking out the menu, checking out the wine list. Anything look good? Um, I don't know yet. They do have some Biltmore wines, which we've enjoyed when we got over to the Biltmore. Here it is right here, the Biltmore Riesling. We've had that before. All right, so they just brought us a candle because we're celebrating a special event, which is no kids. <laughs> a very rare date night. So we're having candlelight dinner by the river. By the river. <laughs> yes. And then you're gonna order a glass of wine? I actually decided to get a glass of Prosecco, sparkling oh, wine. God bless you. <laughs> and um, they did card her. Which she had is, to pull out her uh, ID. It's very exciting. It's always exciting when you get carded, right? Yes. 
Because <laughs> you, you look beautiful. Oh, because I'm still in my 20s. Yes. <laughs> All right, so we're going to skip the appetizers. There's a lot of good looking appetizers. These cheddar cheese bites were, were recommended, but we're going to save room for the salad bar, which is included. So let's take a look at the menu here. If you're interested in just getting the salad bar, it's $15.99 and you can pause the video, take a look at the different sides they have, the different side substitution, as well as the cooking guide for the beef. And over here we've got all the different cuts of steak as well as some other options, chicken, shrimp, salmon, um, and again, a couple more sides if you just wanna do sides in the salad bar. So we don't have children with us tonight, but here's a look at the children's menu. If they just want to do the salad bar, it's 75 cents times their age. But, or if they want to get one of these dinners, they also get the salad bar and fries and a drink for a dollar times their age. So that's actually a really good deal. Okay, let's get back to the video. No pressure. <laughs> it's gonna be all over YouTube. So what is Prosecco, Brie? It's a sparkling wine, or I guess comparable to a champagne. Okay. It's bubbly, it's sweet. It's okay, sweet. if it's sweet, I could go for that. Yeah, you'll like it. All I'll right, the no drip. Thank you. Straight from the bottom. <laughs> <laughs> so it, That's tacky. I can't I can't do dry the dry reds. So let's see how's the perspective how go. This thing. It's good. It's good. I hope it's not too dry for you because it's not super sweet. All right, I'll try it. As Bree just mentioned, this is probably one of our favorite salad bars in the area. Lots of great stuff that you'd expect at a salad bar. Very fresh and delicious. Even some adventurous stuff like anchovies and smoked oysters if you want to try those. All right, so we just got the salad bar. I did like that they had, uh, what are the red things I like? What are those things Beats. called? Beets. That's right. And uh, pickled okra. Anything else on the salad bar? Did you get? You didn't get anchovies? No, no anchovies or smoked oysters for me. So she skipped the anchovies and smoke, smoked, yeah, can't talk, smoke, smoked oysters. <laughs> so anyways, we're going to enjoy our salads. Very nice salad bar, Very nice. but let's uh, pray and enjoy our meal. How's your salad? It's really, really, really good. Their salad bar is super fresh and so many things to choose from. So it's excellent. We also did get some bread. We got some ooh, nice and warm bread and some uh, fresh butter. I did a filet and chicken combo. It's a smaller filet, but I wanted to be able to try the chicken and tell you how the chicken is with steak fries. And then what did you get? I got the New York strip and a loaded potato. So they gave me all my toppings with butter too. So I can make my little potato. It looks pretty good. Did we pay extra for the sides? The sides are extra. I think they were like 50 cents each for your potato. So if you happen to have some extra cheese. Or bacon. Uh, or chives. Know, the cheap dad and me coming out is saying <laughs> the same things on the salad bar. So if you had a little whoop, 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 voila. All right, so she's working on the New York strip. So far, it's very flavorful. It has a lot of good seasoning and good flavor. All right, I'm gonna try this fillet. I ordered medium. It's a little more on the medium well, but looks pretty good. Let's give it a shot. All right, we just tried the chicken. It's got this pineapple on top. It is very tender. It's a good uh, chicken breast. It's good. It has, it has good flavor, kind of like a Hawaiian flavor, I guess would be the best way to describe it. I like it. We're still picking out our salads. Still got some bread. The bread was excellent. The, the butter was really good. Working on our uh, potatoes. So this is a, a good steak and potato type meal that we are enjoying together with no kids. <laughs> All right, so she's abandoning the New York strip and she's got some of my filet. Uh, you're saying the strip is not 
comparable, but yeah. which is better, the filet or the... Well, the strip, the strip is very flavorful, but I just really love a filet. It's just too tender to pass up. We probably ordered too much, but we wanted to try different things for you guys. I think that the, the filet is the move over the strip. So we asked for to-go boxes, and they gave us to-go boxes with foil in a bag, which is actually very functional. That's the word of the week. Everything's functional. <laughs> Practical. Practical. That's a better word. So we're going to box up the rest of our steak. This chicken was very good. I actually was surprised by the chicken. And it's really good with that uh, pineapple on top. So we're about to try some dessert. Yep. We're, we're full, but we're, I mean, we're, we're, we just saved a little bit of room for dessert. Dessert doesn't fill you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's what so, my kids say. So we're gonna try this dessert that looked really good. All right, we saved a little bit of room for dessert. This is Christie's chocolate. chocolate cake. So it's got ice cream on the inside, lots of fudge, homemade whipped cream. So we're gonna try to tackle this together. Mm, looks delicious. Looks amazing. You wanna try a bite? Try a bite. Okay. All right. So Bree is gonna take a bite. It's so fancy. I don't wanna mess it, it is, up. So I just wanna eat the edges. Oh, so there's got a little. Did you eat a little ice cream there? It's very good. Very good. Very rich. I like the ice cream on bottom because the the cake is nice and warm on top, and the fudge is like. You know, like real fudge, not just Hershey syrup. So I just tried this and it is awesome. It's kind of like a ice cream sandwich. It's got a layer of ice cream between two layers of cake. Hot fudge is awesome. Whipped cream is awesome. This is an awesome dessert. Highly recommend it. And it's just fun looking. Yep. Very cool, very unique dessert. Out of 10 stars, what would you give this thing? Mm, I'd give it a solid 7 or 8. Mm, 7 or 8. I would have to agree. It's up there. Very delicious. If you're a chocolate person, this is save some room for this thing. This thing is awesome. All right, so we're still picking up the cake. Very good. There's no way we can finish it, but I'll show you the damage. So I had Kristen. Kristen's great. Did an awesome job. So we got... A filet with chicken that was 38 bucks and then we did get this chocolate cake that was ten dollars and then we got a 10 ounce strip so we got the extras for the uh, baked potato the total was 90 dollars and then you've got some taxes so we're just at a hundred dollars here for dinner for two and uh overall Thumbs up. Thumbs up. I enjoyed it. Great taste. All right, we just finished up dinner at the Peddler. Bree, what did you think? Oh, I thought it was good. I really enjoyed the salad bar, and the filet was really good, and that marinated chicken was excellent. And of course, the chocolate cake for dessert was delicious. So it was a lot of food. I loved looking at the river. That was great atmosphere, great service. Uh, highly recommend. Yeah, so. We tried this New York strip and the filet. The filet was better. Yes. And that marinated chicken actually did surprise me. It was very good. I would definitely order that again. And it's not too pricey. It's $26.99. Plus you get the uh, salad bar. Salad bar is always great. And uh, the dessert was actually really good. So great experience. We'll definitely come back here again. And uh, anyways, if you have any questions about the peddler, drop those down in the comments below. Otherwise, we hope you enjoyed this adventure and we'll see you guys on the next one. Bye. Bye. You went from like- I am not a come. videographer. Well, you Give gotta me a learn. minute. You gotta learn how to do this. this no, 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 either way. You're gonna, no, <laughs> that's the sunroom. Now, oh, too far. Okay. All right, almost. <laughs> Yes, I love technology. All right, so I feel on. like there's this shadow right here. like. So you can see they have a wine list of fruity ones, reds, full-blooded, full-bodied. <laughs> All right, so we just finished up dinner at the Peddler. What did you think? 
Um, I thought it was really good. I... It's alright, keep Car. going. Keep going. Oh, here. Game on. <laughs> alright, so we just finished up dinner at the Peddler. What did you think? One more. Alright. Posture. Head up. Still McKinnon. Here we go. <laughs>